I'm Randy House and I'm a kindergarten teacher from right here in Arkansas. Do you guys like riding roller coasters? I have friends that love to ride them, but I do not. If you've never been on a roller coaster before, you sit in a car of some kind and they usually strap you in and you climb and you climb and you climb until you get to the very top and when you do get to the top, the view is spectacular right before they drop you down the hill again. Now, usually when you get to the top, you scream or you get loud because, again, that view is spectacular and then <gasps> they drop you down. Well, today we're going to play a game using our arm as a roller coaster. We're going to be learning about consonant, vowel, consonant, or CVC words. The vowel is in the middle like this, consonant, vowel, consonant. And just like that, we're going to use our arm as the roller coaster, bottom, middle, bottom consonant, vowel, consonant. And when we get to the top in that middle sound, we're gonna say it louder as if we're at the top of the roller coaster and the view is spectacular. Let's try some words. Let's try the word dip. D, I, P. Do you see where I made that I sound just a little bit louder? That's because I'm at the top and that's the vowel sound. Let's try the word dad. D, A, D. I heard the A sound right there in the middle. That's the short A sound as an apple. Let's try box. B -ox. I heard the A sound as an octopus or short O. Leg. L egg. I heard E right there in the middle as in E, E, egg, short E. Let's try hug. G. I heard a uh, a uh, like umbrella, short U. Kid, k, i, d. I heard i, i as in igloo, or short I. Let's try pat, p, a, t. I heard a as in apple. Web, w, e, b. I heard. Eh, eh, as an egg. Let's do one more word. Sub, s, uh, b. I heard uh, uh, as an umbrella or short u. This trick helps you isolate each phoneme and really listen for that middle sound. This can help you when you're sounding out words to spell. Those vowels can be quite tricky, especially that short I and short E. We get those mixed up a lot. I hope that you'll remember to use your roller coaster arms anytime you're segmenting those phonemes. And I hope that if you do go to an amusement park this summer, you will get to the top and enjoy that spectacular view and be thinking about those short vowel sounds. Have an awesome day and tune in again tomorrow for more fun literacy lessons.